Another London Marathon has just taken place and we've teamed up with Decathlon to test out these, the KD900X shoes. We've created three Strava segments along the London Marathon course and over the course of today we're going to be taking them on and seeing how fast we can do it. Now by the time you're watching this the leaderboard will already be populated with all of you that took on the London Marathon so quick go and have a check at where you place on the leaderboard or if you live locally and you want to give it a go then come and give these segments a try. Also you might want to see where you place on the leaderboard in comparison to Johan who debuted the KD900X shoes running the London Marathon this year. So definitely go and give it a go or just give a segment a go and see where you would place on the leaderboard if you live elsewhere. So now it's our turn. We better go and lay down some Strava segment times. Let's go. Oh, well, before we do though, we've actually got some words of encouragement from Johan. Didn't you used to race against him? Oh, brilliant. This will be great. Hi, Sarah. Good luck for the Strava segment of the London Marathon. If you use the power of the shoes, I'm sure you can win everybody and beat your record. So I trust you for the win. Good luck and let's go. Okay, Sarah, are you ready to go? Ready. In three, two, one, let's go. Oh, she set off at a fairly, fairly quick lick here. No idea if she can sustain that. I think she'll go under four minutes or right around four minutes. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm saying 350. I actually cannot fathom how someone runs this fast over the course of a marathon. Hoping these will be close to the top of the leaderboard. Tens of thousands of runners run down this route every year from the start line here in Greenwich in Blackheath for the London Marathon. So Sarah's following some well-trodden footsteps. Oh, and done. That felt so good. And what a place to finish with an epic view of London that people will get when they start off on their marathon. Pretty chuffed with that as well. Didn't manage to make it under four minutes, but I think with the people dodging, just over four minutes is a pretty good time. If you're enjoying this video, please do give it a thumbs up. Also to cheer on everyone that's taken on the London Marathon. Well done if you've taken it on. If you've taken on a marathon anywhere else in the world this year, let us know in the comments or if you haven't taken on a marathon what would be your bucket list marathon let us know and if you have run a marathon this year pop your time in the comments and we'll come give you some love hi Andy. really long time my friend do you remember in 2010 not far from this mountain in spain barcelona we were together in the 1500 meters really long time ago i wish you really good luck for your running segment of the london marathon so i trust you see you soon Right, Andy, I've done mine, now it's time for you. How are you feeling? Uh, a little bit nervous, gonna have a few more tourists to dodge around here, I think it's a little bit busy around Cuffy Oh, Star. he's Pretty pulling iconic. out the yeah, excuses. The excuses already. Is that, is that you want to beat Andy? Yeah, of course, of course. <laughs> Your goal in life. My goal in life is he to looks, beat Andy. He looks pretty scared, you know. Mo and Sarah, just over there, I can just, just hear smack talk. Three, two, one, go. Go, go on, Andy, Andy. go on, Andy. <laughs> A proper stitch up to give the Olympian the route with all of the people and the traffic. <laughs> How do you think it's going to be? What time? Oh, my money is on 3.10. 3.10? Yeah. 3.30. He was going 3.30. 3.30. Oh, and what do you want to run? 3.29. <laughs> Dodging people, bikes. I'm in a bus lane. I'm not sure how safe that is. Just trying to keep my legs going over this rise these small rises over the course of a whole marathon that just really sap your legs. Okay. 1K done. Hardly 42.2, but that was tough enough. Just puts it in perspective, but that was all out for me. That's my turn done. How fast do you think Mo can do it? Let's find out. Hi Mo, you can push yourself. And I'm sure I can see you on the top of the result after the race. So, you need to believe in yourself and run fast. Let's go, man. Let's go. I'm very, very cold, but I'm feeling excited. I can't wait to just absolutely smash this What's kilometer. What's your kilometer going to start off with? What's the numbers we're looking for? I'm hoping for a four, no, three, no, no, two. Down. You see, there we go, two. That's yeah, what I like. Yeah, yeah. Two. Two fifty-six. That's, that's my absolute fastest. <laughs> oh, that is big talk. So, yeah. uh, <laughs> there's been a lot of talk about beating me, so I think it's about time that you get out there and get stuck in. Three, two, one. Go, go, go! Let's go, Mo. Ow. They've got me starting on a hill. 
I think he'll run about 3.30. We were goading him into like sub three minutes, but I think that's crazy talk. I don't know. He said that the shoes feel pretty fast, so it's time to put them into action, see what they can do. Last segment of the day, the least glamorous in terms of location, but the most glamorous in terms of presentation. He, he's, uh, he's, he's set off and he's at about mile 16 on the course and that kind of pace is just unimaginable that anyone in the actual marathon could be going that pace. Well, apart from the elites who will be whizzing fast at that speed. That's what's really depressing, isn't it? I'm really slow now. I think I went off way all the way too fast. Ah. 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 Okay, I think that's it. That was quite quick. I think that was quick. Just looked at my watch. Can confirm it was quick. That's three segments done. It's a wrap. Bad to you, Sarah. Three savage Strava segments complete. And by the time you're watching this, Mo, you will have run the full marathon. Looking forward to it after that? Yeah, no, I can't. I honestly can't wait for it. I can't <laughs> wait for it. It's going to be great. And Andy, can you imagine running past the Kites Arc that fast during 26.2 miles? Absolutely not. And Mo, are you going to try and beat your segment time when you actually take it on? Literally, when I see the segment, I'm going to go for it. But other than that, no, absolutely. <laughs> going to slow that kilometre right is just going to spike. That one hill is going to kill me, but I need to beat the segment time. <laughs> well, <laughs> definitely go and have a look at the leaderboard if you ran the London Marathon and see where you place against the three of us. And if you're nowhere near London, then head out and do a kilometre time trial and let us know in the comments what your time is and we'll see you next time on the running channel